Good morning, Acadiana. Math may be high on most people's list of important subjects, but not so high on the list of favorite subjects. So how do teachers get kids to enjoy learning numbers? Scott Brasda visited Cathedral Carmel School to find out. It's today's Spirit of Acadiana. Laughing kids, but it's really the numbers and shapes and equations that are rocking at Cathedral Carmel School in Lafayette. The faculty and students have embraced, ta-da, mathematics. It's a student-driven, student-created math convention. The school-wide enrichment showcase is called Do the Math, and what you've got are a number of hands-on exhibitions that spotlight math skills on all grade levels. And while teachers have established the framework, it's the kids who are truly driving this educational bus. So we're making fractions over here. We are teaching how to do area and perimeter. Like counting stuff and like making your things together. They're the teachers. And as their fellow students spend nearly an hour going to different booths, they engage in a bit of peer-to-peer -peer training. You get to be the teacher kind of, what's it like? It's really fun. Instead of being a student, you help them understand things that they don't understand. Okay. And you teach them things. But they're actually doing activities that incorporate their math skills based on the needs that we find for each grade. And then, not only do they learn that skill in the classroom, but now they're teaching it here to the other grades. Standardized test scores suggested to administrators that there's always room for improvement. But are these guys holding a conference? Nope. It's bowling, with a bit of adding and subtracting. It's all about addressing needs in some fun ways. And we target those needs and uh, build lessons around that here at, here at this convention. Do the math, and what's happening at Cathedral seems to be adding up, kind of, sort of. Are you good at math? Yes. Do you like math? Yes. Do you love math? No. <laughs>